Hello, Grace Church. Today we decided to be here in the nave. We are marking the anniversary of the murder of George Floyd, as so many in our country are remembering it today. And Father Jason and I chose this spot in the church because it's one of the few places with all of the representation that we have, it, it's one of the few places where there's some representation of people of color in our church. This is the baptismal window here in the, in the, bab the baptistry area of the narthex. Um, Jesus surrounded by the little children of the world. So we are aware that there's been so much that has happened this year about race at Grace Church, that people have begun to engage the topic and think about race in ways that they really never have before. We've done quite a bit of work in the parish over the past year since George Floyd was murdered last year. We've had a ra racial re reconciliation series of adult forums, book studies, and also uh, different uh, speakers from, from across the diocese and really the Episcopal Church who joined us last year. I'm really pleased that there is a group that is so committed to continuing this work and that right now is in the process of training facilitators for sacred ground which is a curriculum done by the wider Episcopal Church to help people engage really deeply around issues of race. And we are going to, beginning, going to be beginning several sacred ground circles here at Grace Church in the fall. You don't have to wait until the fall though. There are several things that are happening right now, today in fact. The National Church is having a Liturgy of Remembrance that's live streamed tonight at eight o'clock. And the City of Alexandria has information about uh, I believe it's called the George Floyd Remembrance Project, looking at how Alexandria responded to his murder. And information about both of those is in the news section of our website at gracealex.org. So as we mark this one year anniversary of the death of George Floyd, let us join together in prayer. Let us pray. Grant, O oh God, that your holy and life-giving spirit may so move every human heart and especially the hearts of the people of this land, that barriers which divide us may crumble, suspicions disappear, and hatreds cease, that our divisions being healed, we may live in justice and peace. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Be well. God bless. Blessings.